So creating your water line is very important. You normally don't want to be right at the water line since the product is clear. It's good to be two or three inches above that because you never know when you load the boat down with ice, you know, six or seven people and, you know, live wells filled up, you could drop down beneath that and you really never want that gel coat exposed to the salt water. So we had kind of a head start since the boat was in the salt water for quite a bit and we had a bit of a sludge line going underneath here. So we used that as a guide, went a couple of inches above it, and that's what got us our waterline right here. 